laying there in the sun looking at me. Give me that look. Dude, like this whole video is like an Otis bonus. Hi, Otis. And viewers, it is day seven, so it's finally been a whole week. So this is the next day of Lent, and it's finally been around a whole week. And right now, it's almost uh, six forty a.m. I just got up at six thirty, and I'm gonna try and get to Denny Mass this morning. So. Let's see how that goes. Let's see if I hope I don't fall asleep while I'm driving or fall asleep during mass. So, yeah, let's see how that goes. Hi! So, I just finished making it to a uh, church. So now I'm here and I'm gonna just do a little bit of adoration before mass starts. I take a sip out of my tea before I do. Okay, I'm gonna um, leave my camera in the car somewhere and no one's gonna find it or try and steal it or anything. And I'll talk to you guys afterwards. Okay, bye. <coughs> Hi again, my friends and viewers. I just got back from Mass. Pretty good. Um, since I got there early, I was there for, um, they do a rosary before Mass starts. So, yeah, that's good. Um, I'm gonna get home, probably eat something. I don't know. I'm kinda hungry. And so, yeah, <laughs> I'm going to turn off the camera so I drive safely. Um, <laughs> since it's been a week since I changed my seat, I should probably do that again to keep my uh, room clean and maintained. Speaking of which, I wanted to kind of talk about, um, since it's the first week of that past event, how are we going to maintain our uh, Lenten promises during the rest of Lent. And so I might share some of my ideas that I do that even though I'm not the best <laughs> at keeping up with what I have, I'm gonna do my best and that's all we can do, right? Uh, there's a phrase, um, do your best and leave the rest to God. And so I think of that when um, Sorry, I can't talk. I don't know. But yeah, anyway, that's a good quote, and I'll see you guys when I get home. So I'm like almost unfinished, but Otis wants to come in really badly for some reason. Maybe because he hasn't seen me all morning. Otis! Otis! Can you hear him? Hi, good morning. Good morning. Do you want to say hi? He wants to be pet. Oh, just wants to be pet. He just wants to love. Oh my goodness. Bonus bonus. <laughs> I'm gonna have a lot of these. Oh, you're so cute, Otis. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go downstairs and have breakfast soon, and then I'm gonna see what else we can do today. Oh, yeah, we're gonna go to bed. Forgot about that. Okay, <laughs> let's not forget about making my bed. Oh, yeah, and you still got an awesome blanket. I got this for Christmas this year as well. It's, um, our Lady of Guadalupe blanket. And it's like really soft, Mexi. So, yeah. 
So yeah. I like that. <laughs> it's good. And now Odyssey is grooming. Look at you. <laughs> Look at him go. Okay. Okay, I'm hungry. Let's go take this giant pile of bed sheets. And I left my coat up here too. So I gotta take care of that. So thank goodness it all fits in the hamper. So I could just take that down. Like that. And so now I can go down the stairs. I guess in a safer manner than carrying it all with my hands. There we go. Hello again, Flint, and I am doing some laundry. I just had breakfast. I had avocado egg. And so now I'm going to sort out all the dirty clothes, start to load, and then I'm going to make my bed, and then I'm going to see or we could talk about how we're going to maintain our Lenten promises. So I just went to bed. Took a while. Sorry that. Then I just wanted to come to my room and be in my nice, clean bed. This. All right. And I'm playing a uh, Christmas music from 2007. So I don't know how long I can play this until I get copyrighted, but we don't know. I'm recording still. Huh? Otis, you were just being adorable when I started licking yourself. You okay? You're making that weird noise. Where's some more dog is part cat because he does this. Otis, what do you lick? Otis! Yes! You gonna be cute? Otis, you were just doing something. I want to get on camera. And now you're not on camera anymore. Oh. Well, you're still on camera, but you're not doing it anymore. So. I'm not confused why you stopped. I think he wants to play or go outside. I still have to go outside. Yeah. So, you wanna go outside? You wanna go outside? <laughs> okay. Okay, Otis. Look at Sphinxy boy outside. Laying there in the sun, looking at me. Give me that look. Dude, like this whole video is like an Otis bonus. Hi, Otis. He's at the court outside. We're getting a helmet jacket on. Hi, Otis. What's this? Otis, your stomach's still going off. What's up with that? Aw. I hope you feel better, Otis. I don't know why your stomach's doing that. Butterfly. Butterfly, Otis. So cool. It's cherry blossoms, too. I like cherry blossoms. Almond and cherry blossoms, I think, are my favorite flowers. Because, you know, with the uh, dark wood on the trees and the light uh, blossoms, they contrast each other and it looks really pretty. Like dark brown and very white, light pink. Go well together, I think, so. My timer's going off for a laundry. Hi, Otis! You're so cute. Oh, you're so warm, too. Laying in the sun is a good idea. I'm gonna get a carpet, too. And join you. Now we're both on our carpets. Laying down. It's kind of like going to the beach and you're on your uh, towel. 
No, I'm a little carpet right here. Here's Otis with his carpet right there. And we're just soaking in some vitamin D. Soaking in some vitamin rays. Vitamin rays or something, no, no. Sun rays for days? I have no idea what I'm saying. <laughs> Sorry about the quality, but since I'm out here, I might as well mention some good ways to remember what you're doing for Lent. Um, one thing you could do is get a flip notes, or like, no, post-it notes. That's a good way to remind yourself and put them on places that you remember them, like when you're uh, brushing your teeth in the morning or at night. You can write them down there. Or uh, get a schedule or a calendar. Frankly, what I do is I make a reminder on my phone, like the, the note program that's on your phone. And you just make a reminder in the morning, so you have it all day. Ooh, new Life Teen video. You guys should go subscribe to Life Teen, they're a great channel, although most of you who are subscribed to my channel have already done that. So, good for you. But yeah. Let's go subscribe to Life Teen and uh, Emily and Nicole. I think, in fact, everyone who uh, just recently joined my channel like a few weeks ago came here because of Emma. And thanks to Emma for doing that. I appreciate it because I used to have like, I think, a uh, little less than 10 subscribers and then she just like yeeted it up to like 50. So I was like, oh my gosh. And so, yeah. Thanks, Emma. Another good way to remember is, uh, Hmm. Have an accountability partner. Yes. A good way to remember what you're doing for Lent is to have an accountability partner. Now, I don't really have one this year for Lent. I don't think I ever have. But yeah, if you have like a good friend of yours who's also Catholic or just, you know, a good friend of yours, be like, hey, can you remind me every day to like check in on me during Lent and see how I'm doing on my things? It's kind of like a friend who uh, takes in you for doing your homework. Like mom. Mom's your accountability partner for homework, everyone. <laughs> so, yeah. And so, oh, this is all nice and warm. He's been soaking in that sun for so long. Like, he's actually warm, and it's kind of cold outside. Because it's been windy. But, yeah. I think the perfect day is, like, when it's just a little bit windy. And when there's not too much sun, like... This, for frankly, for me, it's too much sun because my hair is burning, and we all know that feeling when you're just like outside the sun, and then you touch your hair up here, and like, oh my gosh, it's burning, or like it's hot. Yeah, <laughs> we all know what that feels like. <laughs> so, yeah. I just noticed that there's like a a stick inside the ground. I think that's a tree. I'm sure. Like, you see that tiny thing? Penny stick right there. See? Look at that. <gasps> Otis! What is it? Oh my gosh, it's really windy. Yeah. That, that pumpkin out there is the one I didn't carve for a Halloween. So I sew, I sewed one instead. I sued, I oh don't know. I sued a pumpkin. The poor pumpkin had to go to court. <laughs> I don't know. Um, so, yeah. Anyway, here's Poppy. See what I mean? Oh, it's all dried up from the top. Yeah. Us? Are you okay? Oh my gosh. And so, yeah. Hopefully it will grow back. I'm not sure. I can't believe I made my bed that I went to Mass, said a rosary, did some laundry, had breakfast, and hung out with Otis today. It's not even noon. Wow. The wonders of not procrastinating. And I was outside for a bit today, too, which is good. You should always try and go outside, even if it's snowy. Or cold or anything, just to know. I know some days I don't go outside every day, but that's because it's like 
wintry. But I guess like you can look out a window. That's just, is it if if looking at a window is uh, <laughs> I can't talk. If looking at a window is as close as you can get, then that's okay too. So yeah. Otis, you're so cute. That's the laundry. Did your smile? Do you guys see his smile? Kinda. Okay, Otis. So I'm gonna go switch over to laundry. Probably start another load. And then I'm probably gonna take all this footage and edit it and stuff so I can finally post more earlier in the day. So I have an idea of how to post is I'm gonna post the day till like maybe like 5 p.m. or something and it goes again later. So I think I'm gonna end the day at 7 p.m. and then if there's anything else that goes on later I will uh, put it in the next vlog. So you'll get uh, Wednesday night, Thursday morning, or Thursday day. So, that way you don't miss anything that goes on. Or anything. Even though technically it's the same day. But it... Yeah, they're all like different parts and stuff. So they also fit. Alright, there's laundry in the dryer. So we gotta take care of that first. So, that's go and do that and I'll see what else we can do. Hi mom. Hi buddy. I have an hour's worth of footage I need to edit. Okay. <laughs> and I guess that number is still counting. Yes. <laughs> Just a little bit. Okay. So we're gonna go take Otis out and then we'll be right back. Okay. Yeah. Hi guys, so it is currently six fifty six PM and so I found out what was going on with Otis. Mom just says it's tummy bubbles. So you guys have never heard before, so I was a little concerned about that. And so anyway, we got back from our walk, um, we had dinner, we had, uh, salmon burgers with, uh, french fries. That was pretty good. Um, yeah. So far, editing has been not too hard, but just because I have so much footage, it's hard to get through all of it. I want to make sure that you guys can actually see me. So it's been hard to get through all of it. So, cause I had like an hour's worth of footage and now it's down to like 45 minutes. And it still needs to go down a bit before I can actually post this. So I might not post around 7 p.m. Excuse me, I'll definitely try and not post around midnight, which is what I did last night. So I'm gonna try not to do that. And anyway, I'm going to think of some ideas of what I can do tomorrow for a video. So, yeah, I'm going to finish editing and try and get this done before 9. Let's set a reminder for 9. Alexa, set a reminder for 9 p.m. What's the reminder for? Panda Fam upload. Okay, I'll remind you at 9 p.m. There we go. So, yeah, I'll go do that. And if there's anything else I haven't seen today, you will see it probably tomorrow in the next upload. So, yeah, please like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you in the next video. And I'll see you tomorrow for Vlent Day 8. That's pretty exciting, guys. And, <clears throat> yeah, I will see you then. Bye.